guys, I'm here to show you how to intentionally corrupt any file on a Windows operating system except for a text document or a .txt. The reason for that is because we're going to be using Notepad to remove some of the hexadecimal values inside of a file and if you open a text document in Notepad you're not going to see the hexadecimal values. Um, although there is a way to corrupt those but that's not going to be included in this video. Just do some research if that is really necessary. Uh, for example purposes, I'm going to be using a song in M4A format, but like I said, it works on videos, PowerPoints, Word documents, you name it, anything but a text document. Um, just to show you that it works beforehand. Alright, so that's a fully functioning song. Um, keep in mind that this process is not reversible. The second you open this up in Notepad and start editing with the hexadecimal values, it's no longer going to work. It's going to be corrupt. So all you need to do is open with Notepad, and every file is going to come up differently. It could be blank. It could be complete gibberish, uh, foreign languages. Uh, my personal favorite is whatever you call this. Um, but as mentioned, it is not reversible. So if even if I were to highlight this nine and delete it, and then put a nine, and then hit save this file would be considered corrupt and it would no longer work. But um, just to be safe, I end up just deleting like a couple of lines and boom, you're done. Just go ahead and file, save that, close it, and when you try to open it, nope, cannot play the file. Uh, again, simple process, works for any kind of file. And uh, yeah. <laughs>